Hey guys, Kristen here. Today I want to talk to you about what recovery looks like. Most people seem to think that like, well, I'm sick today and then the day after I felt a little bit better. So the day after that, I'm sure I'll feel a little bit better and I'll just keep feeling a little bit better until I get up to here, which is where I want to be, which is like super healthy and awesome. However, that's just not how it works, especially with something as mysterious and misunderstood and complex as severe chronic fatigue. What recovery is really going to look like is this crazy wild path of like sometimes you're doing really awesome and sometimes you do really bad and you keep kind of going back and forth and sometimes you feel like you're going in circles and maybe you are. And then eventually someday, hopefully someday not too far in the future, you end up at this place of health that you've been seeking. Now I share this with you not to try to be depressing or to make you feel like this is really out of your control but I really want to help set your expectations on what recovery looks like. The best way to go about this that I've found is each night when you go to bed is to just kind of acknowledge how the day was. Was it a better than normal one? Was it a worse than normal one? Was it in between? Were there parts that were good and parts that weren't so good? I don't know. Just at the end of the day, acknowledge how that day was. And then also realize that however today was, may not impact how tomorrow was at all. You could have a surprise good day or a surprise bad day, or it could be exactly the same, or it could be something you never experienced before. Part of the healing mindset with severe chronic fatigue is being able to accept that we're on a ride and we don't know where it's going day to day. And as long as you can just wake up each morning open to wherever your body is at, it's gonna be put you in the best position to heal and that's because it allows you I should say it encourages you to check in with your body every day and say hey where am I at today and then once you're open to where it's at each morning then you're in the best position to give your body what it needs to heal whether that's more rest or maybe today pushing for a little more exercise you only know the right thing to do when you check in with your body and allow it to be wherever it is day to day removing those expectations of pro continual linear progress because it just doesn't exist that way. I hope you guys found this useful to help frame your expectations around your day-to-day -day abilities. If you want more tips on how to live with severe chronic fatigue, then subscribe to my YouTube channel. I post just about every day. See you soon. Sending you love and health.